Hi Gemini and welcome to my channel. I am an intuitive card reader and this will be a three card spread drawing out some messages that may be helpful for you for the upcoming week, so the upcoming seven days. It will be a general reading. I will be using the Egyptian Tarot. I will list this below in the description box for those interested. I haven't used this deck in a while, Gems. Um, I thought I'd do something different this week. Otherwise, thank you so much for being here, Gems. If you enjoy this content, please feel free to leave behind a like. Uh, so I know I'm doing something right um, and also feel free to subscribe if you haven't already it'd be absolutely wonderful if you could join the YouTube family would be very much appreciated gems otherwise let's get straight into it and see what's coming up for you for the upcoming seven days okay Gemini Sun Moon Rising Venus or if you're dealing with a Gemini Sun Moon Rising Venus this reading could be insightful for you okay Gemini three cards What's coming up for the sign of Gemini? First card you have here, which is the Emperor. Second card here is the Ace of Swords. Okay, wow. And the third card you have is a High Priestess. Okay, this is really intense. Um, there's a beautiful coupling up happening here. This is a golden opportunity. The High Priestess with the Emperor. Whether you're, you're the Emperor watching this, you're being paired with a beautiful High Priestess. Um, and if you're the High Priestess watching this, you're being paired up with your Emperor. This is very much a reading focused on love, power, and the, the notion to prevail. The card of victory, the Ace of Swords is here. So that's absolutely beautiful. Okay, let's talk about the first card here. You've got the very influential Emperor. Now, this is often seen as an Aries. So this might be an Aries you may be dealing with in the upcoming week. Now, the Emperor is very, very powerful, very influential, um, and very, very assertive. There's a lot of determination that comes with the um, emperor. There's a lot of accomplishment. Okay, there's nothing that can withstand this, this person's willpower. There's stability, there's authority, there's integrity. It's almost like this person is indestructible, okay? So this is someone coming in with a lot of power with the emperor here. I do believe if this is in a love sense, um, I do believe this is quite a powerful person. It could be romantic. It could be a father figure. It could be an elder brother. It could be a friend. But it's someone coming in with emperor energy. Now, this could also be you, Gemini. Um, and what does that say? What does that say? That says determination. That says will. This says a lot of power and or influence looms around you. And the power you have within yourself is going to affect a lot of other people around you. Um... Some of you will attract someone you've been meaning to attract here, okay? They're very attractive with the emperor energy. They're very powerful. They're in high places. Now, it could be through work. Um, oftentimes, the emperor is comes with a very intimidating energy. So I feel like it's, it's an energy where you may feel that something's too good to be true or you can't believe this person's paying attention to you, Gemini. It's almost like a bit of disbelief. But... The High Priestess works in mysterious ways, um, and I think this is very, very big for you in the upcoming week. Now, this could be in a career sense. You might have an ep emperor, a manager, a CEO, a recruiter, um, a company that's giving you a chance here because you've got this golden opportunity. This is the Crown of Hathor with the Ace of Swords here. This is, this is a beautiful opportunity. It's quite a prestigious opportunity. Um, now, whether it's with someone romantic, whether it's in the creative sense, perhaps professionally or in a collaborative um, venture, it could just be the case. It's prevailing. It's victory. It's, it's being in the public eye, possibly notoriety here uh, with the Emperor. I feel like someone big is taking a chance on you or someone big is noticing you. You're dealing with the big fish now here, Gemini. The beautiful Ace of Swords in, sits in between the Emperor and the High Priestess. This is something dynamic, okay, but it's a struggle to get there. So you've struggled, you've thought tooth and nail for this person's attention, tooth or nail for this job opportunity, and it's finally coming to pass here. The High Priestess doesn't bring anything minor into our lives. In fact, the, the reason why she's, she's come up in your weekly reading is to show that she's making sure a prophecy comes true for you, possibly connected with this Emperor or with the High Priestess herself. Um, and she's summoned the power to give you this opportunity here. Now, this is an opportunity destined for you because it's the swords. You are the swords um, through and through. So the fact that it's come up for you, this is a crown. 
this a very prestigious or upscale or lucrative opportunity or a chance to be with someone that's very well connected, very affluent, very respected, very powerful or has a lot of influence over other people is what I'm seeing here. Um, but victory, you've, there's hardship connected to this opportunity. You've done the hard yards here. It's time that it, that it happens for you here, Gemini. This is what I'm seeing. Absolutely beautiful. It could be a new romance with an Aries or an air sign, a Gemini, Libra or Aquarius. Um, it's destined to be something powerful. This is the power couple. The emperor and the high priestess are very powerful in their own right. They're very influential in their own right. Um, very strong connection here. Okay, there could be a bit of clashing, what looks like horns here, okay, your horns may clash between this person because you have, you've got very strong and dominant personalities here, but for the main part, victory can result, it's sitting in the middle here, it, this crown is shining for you, this is very powerful, you also have the high priestess, which I mentioned can bring upon prophecies, things that are meant to be in our path, things that are meant to come to us, the high priestess can also point to mystical, meta metaphysical energies here, so you may find you're having dreams, premonitions, visions, affirmations, signs, synchronicities or symbols coming to you through the conscious or the subconscious level of what this opportunity, of what is yet to come to pass. Now, she also rules pregnancy. So for some of you, there's a notion of pregnancy within your family, um, within your extended family, possibly a dear friend. There's a struggle, something to do with a struggle and then a pregnancy or the struggle to give birth to an idea. Maybe this is a project you've been wanting to bring to your boss, to your superiors, and you've been struggling to find the time, um, you know, to, to, to find the time to, to bring forward that pitch or that idea or to find the, the people that will listen here, Gemini. This is all coming to fruition. The High Priestess summons a powerful energy for you in the upcoming week, okay? Um, and you can definitely prevail over any obstacles or anything that has held you back in the past in the upcoming seven days. There's a surge of energy here and it's falling in your favor. There's also an emphasis, uh, you know, on the metaphysical, spiritual, religious life, theology, philosophy. This is an emphasis for you here. So I'm not sure if you'll be consulting some sort of guru or you'll find someone that will influence your path Perhaps in the next seven days, you know, it could be a life coach, a guru, a spiritual leader. It could be a religious text, but something that's going to help you, okay? Help you pray, help you overcome obstacles and help you find victory. Help you, um, help you encounter these changes that the high priestess can often bring to us very, very suddenly here. So I will leave it at that though, Gems. Quite a powerful reading this week. I hope it's been enjoyable. Thank you so much for watching. Sending you all my love and all the best. Bye for now.